This video is all about using a green mat video inside Unity 3D. I am downloading this video from video.net. There are so many free green screen videos available in this website. The green screen footage credit entirely goes to its author in video.net. Now we import the video in After Effects. Drag the video and place it on the new composition icon to create a new composition. We have to double the width of uh, the video in order to use it inside Unity 3D. Currently our video width is 2048. So I am going to double it in the composition setting. Set the width to 4096. Now we need to move our video to left corner. To do that I am setting the position value to 1024 to place exactly on the left side corner then duplicate the video and move it to the right side corner To do that, I am setting the position value to 3072. Alright. Now, right click on the left side video and choose key light 1.2 and select the screen color using the eyedropper tool. Now, select the key light effects and copy it using Ctrl C and uh, paste it onto the right side video using control V then go to the right side video ski light options and change the view from final result to screen mat now your footage is on the left side and screen mat is on the right side this is what we need render the video to MOV and convert it to MP4 using any converter of your choice and get the rendered video into unity 3d in my project i have the video on a background image inside the assets folder right click on the hierarchy and create a 3d plane scale the plane with respect to the video that we rendered in my case the video resolution is 4096 1080 so I scale the game object to match the aspect ratio of my video. And create another plane for the background image. Then drag the background image onto the plane. Yes. Align both the planes to center of the scene. Move the video plane to right side and to little front. This is the shader I use on the game object in which I play the video. Now create a new material and change it to custom transparent. Then drag the material and place it on the video plane game object. And select the video plane game object and add a video player component. 
now select our video in uh, the video clip and that's it we are ready to go thanks for watching